Hello everyone, welcome back to Trade Masters channel where we decode the toughest of stocks with the simplest technical patterns. So today we're going to analyze uh, Kirloska Brothers and uh, it's, a, it's a part of the famous uh, Kirloska group. So as such it is a fundamentally strong company and their uh, parent company is also fundamentally strong. And if you look at the business model of Kirloska Brothers, they are majorly into engineering and manufacturing of fluid management uh, systems like, uh, for example, water pumps, power plants, irrigations, uh, you know, pumps, motors and hydro turbines, etc. Et so these guys are majorly into engineering and manufacturing of a wide variety of infrastructure projects and pumps. So that is the business model of Kirloska Brothers. And if you look at the balance sheet of Kirloska, it is uh, really good. There is nothing, uh, you know, negative on the balance sheet viewpoint. And uh, since this particular video is going to be a swing type of trading setup, I'm not uh, going to show the fundamental uh, perspective of Kirloska. And we are going to go ahead only with the technical uh, patterns. Okay, so let's get into the video. So this is a four hour time frame chart, what I'm showing over here. And the first thing what we need to do is we need to plot the support and resistance. So over here, I see this particular zone as a strong level of support. So the support zone, I'm marking it in uh, blue. So let me just pull it over here. So this is a strong level of support zone, what I see over here. So the support zone basically got formed over here. And after that, it took support once again. And once again, it's acting as a support over here. Right, so this is on the support and uh, resistance basis. So we have a strong level of support somewhere around uh, 780 levels. And it has, the stock has been continuously touching the support zone and it is reversing. So this particular zone is gonna act as a strong level of support. And if you plot a trend line like this on the upper side, then this particular pattern becomes a descending triangle pattern. So this is a one type of uh, advanced uh, technical pattern that we teach in our course. And uh, actually the breakout happened on the upper side. So if you look over here, on uh, Wednesday, 4th of October, we have the stock is closing somewhere around uh, 834 rupees. So it is actually broken out of the support zone over here on uh, Wednesday. And after that, on Thursday, the stock gave a gap up opening and it is closing above that. So after that, we have a good uh, three candle formation. So this is a three white soldier candle formation. And after that, the stock is trying to retest over here. So this is a clear cut breakout in the descending triangle pattern. And I believe the stock can go up to somewhere around 980 in the coming future. So that is going to be my prices, uh, you know, uh, target price as well. So coming to my entry price, so over here, uh, my entry price is going to be buy and dip still 830. So somewhere around 830 is going to be my best buying zone. So from the current market price till my best buying zone, we have a difference of almost 50 points. So it is not advisable to enter the current market price. I'll be uh, clearly explaining where and when you need to buy this particular stock. So please pay attention and uh, don't skip this video. Okay, so before entering into the entry price, we just need to finalize the target. So 980 is going to be the final target what I'm freezing for uh, Kirloska Brothers. And stop loss over here, you can keep below 775. So below this particular point, that is 775 can be a good level of stop loss. Now coming to my entry price. So if I'm calculating my risk reward from here, and this is going to be my stop loss and this is going to be my target, I'm gonna get a risk reward of only one is to one point, uh, one is to one. So that's basically a risk of one, uh, a risk of one point, it's uh, equal to a reward of uh, one point, right? So that is not a pretty great uh, risk reward ratio. So risk reward ratio plays a crucial part when you're investing. You need to keep a minimum of one is to 1.5 risk reward ratio so that you can uh, get a go good amount of returns if you're, even if you have a very bad accuracy of at least 50 percentage, right? So that is why risk reward is a very much important uh, part of a uh, trader when he is investing or when he is trading in any script in any uh, part of the day. Okay, so what minimum risk reward what we are going to keep is uh, 1 is to 1.5. So for a risk of 1 point, my reward is going to be almost 1.5 points. Right, so over here, what I'll be doing is I'll be waiting for the stock to come down till at least 860. So if the stock is coming down to 860, maybe I'll enter somewhere around 30 per stage at 860 and remaining I'll be keep on adding it in dips till 830 or 825. So that is going to be my investment strategy in Kirloska Brothers. I repeat, it is not advisable to buy at the current market price of 881 because the risk reward is not that great. So wait for the stock to come down till 860 and then you can start accumulating in the stock and uh, keep your stop loss at 775 and you can keep a target of almost 980. So this is going to be my investment strategy or this is going to be this is going to be my uh, entry strategy in Kirloska Brothers.
right and uh, coming to my uh, returns so let's say like 830 is going to be my good level of buy price and this is going to be my final target so i'm looking at a returns of almost 19 percentage not to mention this is going to be a swing type of trading setup and the maximum holding period is going to be just within a period of 40 days so within a 40 days holding period i'm looking at a returns of almost 20 percent so that's a pretty good uh, return on investment right so this is, is entirely a swing type of trading setup and uh, you know don't uh, miss q on the entry price because that is where we we are going to make a huge amount of uh, money because as if your average buying price is going to be much lower and uh, that is going to you know uh, minimize your risk uh, uh, much lower and uh, you can expect a good amount of returns once your final target is done all right so that pretty much concludes the technical viewpoint on kilos car brothers i hope this video was useful and i hope you learned some informative things from this video and as usual if you like my analysis please do click on the like button and if you want to support our channel please do consider subscribing to our channel as well i'll see you guys in the next video till then it's bye from chris take care bye bye and thank you for watching